Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my <clears throat> May 1st through the 15th empties. Um, I'm actually surprised on how much I got through. Um, considering for the fact of one weekend I was gone and I had all my wax warmers turned off for a few days. Um, I actually still got through quite a bit. Um, I used uh, 23 units, um, which is higher than my average, or way higher than my average, I think, actually. My other highest was, that I got through was 24, so it's almost my highest. So, I got through this True Living Fresh Melon, which this one I really liked. Um, I really love the melon scents. Um, but this one was a little bit waxy smelling, um, so I wouldn't repurchase that one again. The next one is Sugar Lavender Twist. I absolutely love this one to sleep with. Mm, this one's just amazing, um, and I will definitely be repurchasing multiples of those. What happened, baby? I miss her. Hmm? I miss her. Yeah? I can miss her. Oh. That's Miss Ann's hand. Yeah, that's my hand. I'm talking to the camera. This one is Middle Earth, which is dirt, rosemary, and fresh mint leaf. This one I didn't really like. Oh, he's going to touch. Oh, there's Salem's hand. You see Salem's hand? Okay, back up. You want to smell? <laughs> this is Salem. He's turns three next month. Okay, no more please. And um, so this is his first time really seeing me film. No, no thank you. Okay. And so, um, but anyways, he loves smelling my wax. <laughs> no thank you, Salem. No thank you. So I would not repurchase that one again. You want to hold this for me? Here, hold it right here. You hold it. Say this one is winter berry zest. This zest. Yeah. I didn't really love this one that much. Um, it was, see them, no thank you. I wanna, they wanna see. They wanna see this. So I probably won't repurchase that one again. Can you go play with your toys please? No. So this one is Casper from Super Tarts. I can't read that one on camera. It's. Toasted marshmallow, vanilla bean noel, cornbread, and Mexican fried ice cream. Do you want to smell? You want to smell this one? You like it? You like it? I really did like this one. I had this one in the. Okay. Put your hand down, please. They want to. They need to see this. Um. I really liked it. Oh, you're kicking my stand. Please, please, no, thank you. Please stop. So, um, I really liked this one. I would definitely repurchase this one again. Salem, if you put your hand in front of the camera like that again, you're going to go sit in your room. Thank you. So, I definitely will repurchase this one again. I really love that one in the living room. This one is Eye Zombie Twisted Peppermint and White Clouds. Um, this one was really nice in the bathroom. Um, had that nice because I put um, one cube, oops, one cube in the bathroom, and then I do one cube in the laundry room. <clears throat> They're right across the hall from each other, so they kind of come out into the hallway. And then, um, <clears throat> so this one went really well for both the bathroom and the laundry room because it has that um, fresh scent as well for perfect for the laundry room. And then lastly for clamshells. I have the Scentsy in Sleigh Bells. Um, oops. I really didn't like this one. I don't know if it's just because it was old when I got it or if that's how it truly smells. But um, I really did not like this one at all. It was like a off peppermint. It was like a peppermint cake scent maybe. And I just didn't like it. So next I'm going to do some cups. So for clams, I went through seven clams. And then cups, I went through four cups. 
So I went finished this watermelon lemonade by Candy Panda. This one was actually decently strong. I mixed it, um, I did it twice in my bedroom. One half I did in my in one warmer in my bedroom, and then the other half I did with a uh, a watermelon taffy um, scent. I don't remember what vendor it was from. But, um, and then I did the other half with it again today. So, um, Grandma's sleeping. She's in her bed sleeping. Don't wake her up, please. So I would um, not purchase this again because I'm not purchasing any Candy Panda, but I was really happy with this one. Um, next we have Wonderberry Candy Loops. Um, this was my first um, Fruit Loops um, blend. And I didn't love it, but I did not like it either. It was nice. Um, I would, um, I might purchase something else with um, Fruit Loops in it again, but it's definitely not something I'm going to order lots of. But I did like it, so, um, yeah. So, this next one is Sassy Girl Aroma Cactus and Sea Salt. Um, so, this one I've done once, and I put it, I rebagged it, because, um, was this one I rebagged? The clean, I think the lid was cracked, wasn't it? I don't remember. I, I swear this one's in the bathroom still, though. Oh, that's what... Yeah, that's what was broken. Um, I knew something on it was broken, but I have used it once and I really liked it. It was really nice in the bathroom, and so I still have another half in the bathroom that I will be using up for the rest of that. Um, lastly, we have Rainbow Melts Visions of Sugar Plums, uh, Sugary Plums, and Cotton, can fro cotton Candy Frosting. This one was really nice. I did this one in uh, my bedroom. Um, I really liked it. It was a good scent. I would consider purchasing it. Eh, actually, I probably won't purchase it again, but I do want to try more plum scents. Now for all the bags. I think I have them pretty much together. Let me look. Okay. Yeah, that's Daddy's. In a minute, okay? In a little bit. Let me finish. Okay, so Vintage Road Candles, Warring Twenties. Old Time Barbershop, Old Wood, Old Wood, Sweet Tobacco, and Kentucky Bourbon. I really, really like this one. It's a really nice um, manly scent. I did this one, I believe, in the bathroom, and I really enjoyed it. It was a really nice scent. Next for Vintage Road Candles, I have Raspberry Rose Snow Fairy. Raspberry Jam, Strawberry Jam, Rose Jam type, and Snow Fairy. This one was really nice. I did this one in the living room, and it was just a really nice um, scent. I don't remember particularly picking out any scents that like really stood out but it was just a really nice sweet um blend and I was a little worried because I'm not I don't love rose I'm not a huge fan of rose scents but I did like it um next I have this material girl um by the bunny sisters this one was really nice actually um I don't know how to explain it. I'm not very good at um, explaining scents yet, but I did definitely like it. So next I have a couple of Bathing Garden. Um, when I got the Alice uh, Collection Sampler, I think is what it's called. Um, lemon Tea Party. Um, I liked this one. I did this one in the bathroom. Um, I did all of these, I think, in the bathroom, and then I mixed it with a... Um, a mint. I did a, these ones in the bathroom and then I did a peppermint in the laundry room. And I like this one. It was just a nice lemon scent. Um, nothing. Um, there it goes. Nothing. I, mm, I don't think I would purchase it again. Um, I think only one of these I would purchase again. Um, this next one is Manage Poor, Poor Flamingo. 
Um, this one was, uh, I think, kind of uh, floor, not florally, um, perfumey, if I'm remembering correctly. Um, like a, a, a floral, a perfumey, fruity scent, and I didn't really like that one a whole lot. Um, this one is the one that I would repurchase again, is As Lost as Alice, and this was like a lavender, herbal lavender something. Um, but I did like that one, and I would consider purchasing that one again. Next, I have a couple of front porch. I have a um, Hawaiian suntan lotion. This one's nice. I have it in the bathroom today. Um, it wasn't super strong when I, I don't particularly remember walking past it and um, noticing it, but um, I do like it when I went into the bathroom to use the bathroom. I did like the smell of it. The next one here is, come on, Watermelon Candy. This one actually had absolutely um, no scent at all. Um, it had, I think, three or four um, pieces left in it. And I melted them, took it out, and then the next day I did it again. And then I did it for two or, th I think, three days. I think there was three in there. And, and then I put in something new after just because there was no scent. I'm gonna put you guys back just slightly so you can see this new pile I'm making. Um, next I have an L3 um, Coconut Coast. I'm not a huge fan of coconut but I did like this one. Um, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't, um, I don't know, I just kind of liked it actually. It was nice uh, scent in the bathroom. Next by Hayden Rowe I have sweet grapefruit and I liked this one as well this one was a, a really nice summery scent um, it is actually a little more overcast today and um, cool but uh, a couple days ago um, it was um, really sunny and warm out and I put this in my bedroom and it was really nice so this is what I was melting with the um, bathing garden the Alice melts uh, Rainbow Melts Let It Snow, which is sweet snow taffy, peppermint sticks, and frosted white cake. So yeah, I definitely like this one. I melted um, a piece by itself before I did the sampler, so that way I knew what it was on its own as well. And um, I would definitely look into purchasing this again. And I definitely want to um, buy one of the Rainbow Melts um, advent calendars again. I really like that one when I did that one in 2017. So this next one is, I don't remember who this was from, what what vendor, but um, this is Fizzy Pop, um, and I absolutely love this. Oh, I melted this with something. I mixed it. Mm. I don't think I mixed it with something here. I think I mixed it with something I'm still melting on, but um, I really did like this one. It was great by itself and mixed, so I would definitely um, purchase more uh, Fizzy Pop from anyone doesn't really matter the vendor and so the bags that I used up this month are 12 so I've used up a total of 23 so far um, I haven't bought any and I don't think I will well I might place one order this month um, I almost placed it or an order with um, L3 for the Mother's Day um, sale but I think that's already over, so I probably won't. Um, but with this uh, next paycheck coming in, um, I'm hoping to um, place an order because I do want to do one last order before it starts getting too hot. And this uh, week has been pretty cool, so I want to get something ordered this week um, so that way it's before it starts getting in the 90s again and the truck is 110 if not more um, so yeah I'm I'm doing pretty good that number is still going down and that's all that truly matters so um, thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video bye